So let's take a quick look at the setup and admin portal for the CSGM 106. Per the setup page that came with it, it gives us a, a IP address 192.168.8.1 to log into the device and it gives us a username and a password which I'm going to go ahead and enter and then I'm going to hit log in and see what happens. Myself success flag at the top and we are into the admin panel. So a little diagram of the device again, showing my connected clients, showing the temperature, a nice room temperature here, and the battery status, general stuff on it. So I'm going to look at the different options here on the left, starting with wireless. So I have gone in here once before, and I did change the SSID from their standard one. And I did change the Wi-Fi key. Remember, it's got to be at least eight characters. Once you do that, uh, in order to make those changes, you have to click Modify, and then it opens these up. And then you hit Apply. If you do change something essential like an SSID or a Wi-Fi password, it will boot you, as it should, and you'll have to re-log back in. So that'll cost you a minute or two. I didn't want to put on to the recording. You can also set up a guest Wi-Fi if you wish. Shows my clients that are connected to it. That's great. Upgrade. So if I have, I want to keep a look at the uh, software and firmware. So this allows me to do so. I've clicked over into auto upgrade and I click this button on because I always want to make sure I'm staying up to date with my security and my features. Firewall, if you have your own, you can go ahead and enter the information in there. If you're using a VPN, several of the major ones are already loaded right there and you can put in your specific credentials. Applications. If I want to do remote access, I can click here and give me different options to be able to do so. And more settings if I wish to do something with, let's just say, uh, network mode, and I want to put this in a pass through mode, I can do that. So just letting you know what's there and how simple it is for it to work. There it is, the CSG M106 admin panel.